Hearst and Wiseman opened the hatch on the vehicle at 4.02 a.m. Central Time. A view here of uh, Swanson in front of the hatch as he is opening it. That uh, delivered to the station 300 or th 3,300 uh, pounds of cargo, including several satellite experiments and uh, some fresh food for the crew. Reed Weissman floating in and out of view there in front of the uh, Cygnus craft now open, as you can see. This again took place at about 4.02 a.m. Central Time this morning. And Alexander Gerst there now uh, in view as well after having been behind the camera for the first part of this clip. In addition to the satellite experiments and the uh, fresh fruit and other supplies, uh, there are also several nano racks experiments, uh, 15 independent studies selected from 1,344 student team proposals. Those experiments look at a range of subjects from food growth and consumption uh, to determining the effects of microgravity on oxidation and even the production of penicillin in space. The satellite experiments include a fleet of nano satellites designed to take images of Earth, uh, some technology demonstration satellites that uh, would eventually be intended to help enable small samples be returned to Earth from the space station, and then also upgrades for the station's three spheres of satellites, which are used for a variety of experiments in space.
Again, this is video from a hatch opening earlier today, actually at 4.02 a.m. Central Time of the Cygnus Orbital Spacecraft. Uh, arrived at the space station yesterday and uh, was birthed to the space station with uh, Swanson, who you see here, at the controls of the space station's robotic arm, along with Alexander Gerst. That's all after it launched from the NASA Wallops Flight Facility in Virginia at 11.52 a.m. Central on Sunday. Work is designated primarily for Reed Weissman and, of course, the crew, in addition to all the needed supplies and uh, new experiments for them to work on, they'll be able to enjoy some fresh food brought up inside, including some fruit, uh, sausage, and cheese for them to enjoy.